Hi guys, Adam here. So in this video, I will tell you how chemical flushes can damage your cooling system. Why it's a waste of money to use it every single time and and show you actual practical proof too. I will also tell you when you should consider using it by inspecting your radiator and some other things too. So let's get started. The coolant I use in my machine has one air use. My coolant still looks good, but after its life is over, it will now begin to slowly corrode and damage my cooling system. If I didn't change it on time, it will look like this. Now for first part, how chemical flushes can damage your cooling system. Car engines have different seals called gaskets. They are in many areas of your machine and cooling system. These chemical flushes are very strong chemicals. They can clean your entire cooling system of rust, but they also damage seals in your cooling system. If you keep using it, you might get a gasket leak or something similar. I will show you proof later that you don't need to use it every time. So it's time to change my radiator fluid. If you want to see a detailed step by step guide on how to change it and clean radiator cooling system of your car, I will post link to a video in description. In that, I give a step by step detailed guide on how to change radiator fluid and clean the entire cooling system of your car. I cannot see any rust particles, but it can settle down as coolant is not flowing right now. Let's take it out. Ok, I am not seeing any rust particles right now. So in case of my machine, my coolant did its job very well. And I don't even need to do any other further flushes. I can simply add fresh coolant directly. But for this video, let's go a little further and do a flush with regular water and see if I spot something in clear water. Nothing here, let's do another flush with regular water. But this time I will run it for long time. As you can see, water is crystal clear. Now I will do flush using chemical flush. All these have different instructions on different brands, so read it. In my case, pour it in radiator, mix with water and idle engine for 10 to 30 minutes. I will let it idle for 30 minutes and come back. Ok, so 30 minutes have passed and this is what it looks like, not a single speck of rust. Previously when I cleaned radiator with water and it began to came out clear, I added chemical flush and this is what it brought out. So it worked great in that case. Right now it didn't do anything other than wasting time and money. One more thing to keep in mind, when you use chemical flush, always do at least two additional flushes with regular water. So all of its chemicals come out of radiator. Some of water stays inside your cooling system, not all of it comes out. And if it has these flush chemicals, it can cause severe damage to your cooling system. So you saw with proof you don't need to use chemical flush every single time and it damages seals touching cooling system. But when you should you use it? If you see your coolant something like this, then you need to clean your cooling system and you need to use chemical flush for that. Again, complete step by step video of how to perfectly clean your cooling system is available with link in description. And if you see that coolant is perfectly green and clean of rust, you don't even need to do flushes with water. Just remove the old coolant and add fresh coolant in the radiator. Another thing to note here, if you change your coolant on time, you don't need to go through the lengthy process of what I did previously. In case of that video, it's because I got scanned by a mechanic. This was the result of using bad coolant for just 6 months. And I was like, you know what, I will do it myself properly. All coolants have different lifetimes. So follow that strictly. So change your coolant on time and you will be happy, your car will be happy, everyone will be happy. And you will never need to use harsh chemical flushes too. I hope this video helped. If so, then like this video as it tells YouTube that my video is useful. You can ask anything in comments and I will see you guys again.